So today we are checking out the Vifly Storp Platium. So if you're one of the many pilots looking to fly your camera drone at night, this tiny yet powerful FAA certified strobe light is a game changer. It is marketed to be visible from over 3 miles away and it's super easy to set up. So let's jump into a quick demo to see it in action and I'll also share some of my night footage of it operate at dark and let's get started. Okay, first let's just open this real quick so you can see that it comes with a USB-C cable to USB-A and a thank you note. Okay, so basically that's it. So you get a Velcro, Don't make sure you don't lose these because I think these are the most easy way you can basically mount it onto your drone. So as I was just saying, this will most likely be used heavily on camera drones because most likely that's when you need this, but it can also be attached to an FPV drone as well. So if you wanted to operate at night, the installation is like really, really simple. You can either use the Velcro tape that came with this and basically this side goes here, the other side goes to your drone, you stick it on, or you can just use a sticky pad or just zip tie it somewhere on your drone and basically that's that's just the simple setup that you can possibly imagine and also since this also has a battery you do not require a additional power source but you do have to charge it using the USB-C port right here so the charge is going to take about 1.5 hours for to charge and the charging voltage recommended to use on this is going to be 4.5 to 5.5 volts which your usual iPhone charger should be just fine so once it has been charged up, it should be able to give you about four hours of continuous runtime. The weight is only about six grams, so it's definitely not something that will be a burden of the operation of your quad. The store palladium does come with about 10 light modes, which can be controlled by the button right here, uh, usually right here. So let me just demo it to show you what they look. To operate this, you basically have to activate by long pressing the short button right here. It basically, it's gonna hurt your eye if you're just looking at it. I'm still gonna demo it and I hope you can see it in the camera. So the first one is going to be a white LED strobe. So which is gonna be the default mode. So if we power it on, you can see that this is the white LED strobe. I don't know if it's gonna be showing on the camera because it's so strong. And the next mode is going to be the white LED flash. Okay. So next should be white LED solid. Okay, this is the flash actually. So I forgot to press it. Wait, this is a white LED flash, white LED solid. And basically the next is going to be red LED strobe, red LED flash, red LED solid, and green LED strobe and green LED flash and green LED solid and basically the next one is going to be all lights that is strobing and if you wanted to turn this off all you have to do is long press and basically it will exit out okay so I think this is basically all the stuff you need to know so let's just put it on like outside at dark to see how it actually performs at night all right let's get going okay so just let you sort of have a reference of how dark it is this is basically my front yard and let me just we'll probably we just walk over there we'll leave it there flashing to see if we can actually see it's not that dark but basically that's what you need right because if it's completely dark it's going to be e even easier to spot it so this is definitely very very strong so let's just probably leave it somewhere on the floor right here so let me activate it okay dang this thing is like it's gonna it's a, probably my neighbors are gonna kill me let's go. Okay, I don't know if you can see it, but it's definitely visible. It's like really strong, like you can see it. Okay, we should come here a little bit so the grass is not blocking it. Yeah, so I, I'm pretty confident that this can go probably three miles, but yeah, you don't want to fly three miles at night. So I think, yeah. All right, let's go back to the bench and let me talk about some of my final thoughts. Short test, but I think this is worth it. <laughs> Okay, so we're back to the bench and yeah, so I would definitely suggest you not to look directly into this thing, otherwise you're gonna get burned. It just hurts. Right now my eyes is all like all like kind of blurry right now. I can't even see the camera. So definitely this is something that you wanted to get if you wanted to operate at night. You it's just so easy to use and I think it's relatively like inexpensive. So this is something definitely worth it. Anyway, so I guess this is about it for this video. And if you wanted to look at this product, some links are gonna be down below. For any questions or comments, 
feel free to leave it down below. Please subscribe and stay tuned and I will see you in the next video. Bye for now.